Mm -hmm. Welcome to GH Newspaper Update of the Week. Mm -hmm. We are glad to be back here, yeah. and we are glad for you to be back listening to us. We miss you, and we hope that you'll be returning frequently. Mm -hmm. I am here with my brother, Kelly. Yeah, man. And I'm Elam. Hey. And I'm here to give you the juicy news of the day. So today, um, I have the daily graphic. Yeah, I also have the daily guide over here. So you want to start? On the front page of the daily guide here, yeah, I have three shots dead at Brave Crew. Courts have no business in our, in our work, speaker says so. Anti-LGBTQ bill, SC, decides application, 17th July. Mm. And it says what, Nana elevates Herbert Krapa to Minister of State. And it says, Ochin oh, Hene uh, calls for environmental stewardship. Yeah, so that's it for the front page. Mm. So let's get right into it. You know, Chairman. Mm -hmm. I get some nice a year for year. Yeah. It says what? No clean water for a check it. You know, I check it. I check it food or some town or what? It be, it be food. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm not saying get some food I check it. Yeah. But now I want to find out say maybe some town that they call a check it. Very nice, man. It did like that. Oh. Yeah. Charlie, what are people doing? Chop pump up. What you want to chop? Kaboom kwa. This so some uh we went for um some village inside then they complain say they know they get clean water to prepare them a favorite food oh. which is um achake. and they are saying that not to talk of um drinking water which the galam say is polluting oh wow you understand so it'd be very alarming issue to the public to the extent that right now people who get clean water made them drink they made them also cook so it it, it, look, it it look like that town no self no yeah it no be main street pipeline it be the river side where they use exactly. the cook exactly. where the galamsey mess them up now yeah. first of all where the galamsey no mm -hmm. i don't know i really don't know because my question be say yeah. you think say if government really won't stop galamsey they no go fist up oh then go fist up so then what will they try to be say government don't want to stop them? They don't want to stop them. I mean still some people, some towns still they run Galam see. You That's see? They here right now. Some towns still run. If, if, if something where it did, wow. see, they still they run Galam see. You see, it, it just be say, it all boils down to the economy. And people trying all kinds of means to make a daily living. Yeah. You don't understand. But first of all, you know, the water thing we they talk about, mm -hmm. to be very frank with you, I don't think saving mainstream pipeline water self be clean. Charlie, Charlie you know, I say eh, I change the filter for my house. Eh, the filter mm. after just two weeks, you see the level of debt with the inside. Eh, I go show the picture. So it means say the water where they come now. I know say sometimes they go blame them on the pipeline. So you won't tell me say the pipeline will constantly be that dirty. It'd be very, very Why then they purify the water? Then they they, they, they try make them clean for us, no? My question is, say you shall say then they put in enough effort to make sure at least even the pipeline where they the water where they run through on a pipeline yeah. will go fit to even drink them. That's because the some countries pipe water will go fit drink them. South Africa will go fit drink them pipe water. Yeah. But how dare you? You did drink pipe water for Ghana. Hey, chairman, sometimes how you go do? Hey Charlie, Charlie, no, 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 you for be careful sometimes. because. No, 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 if you be careful. Because more people, more people they drink. Oh wow. Oh wow. Because if you don't get money by pure water, water. Charlie, then if you depend on that one. It's no, but Charlie, the level of debt where they that water inside. Yes. If we really they consume that water in our system, mm -hmm. then when our system they suffer. Really? Because I say I go show a picture of the filter. Yeah, yeah. It be brown. Mm. It be serious. Seriously yeah, brown. Very, very serious. Where do I make it poor people them are poly tanky under? Because the that settle for under it be brown. You for the wash your poly tank every single time. Yeah, yeah. So the waterway that they provide for us for Ghana actually serve no good. Yeah. At least the river one they know say them for boil up. Yeah. But something where they run through your pipeline, you they trust say Ghana water sewage, they take them through a good process to make them drinkable. That's but Charlie, I know they think they be drinkable. No, no, no. They are not they are not trying because they know they filter themselves. Yeah. So if, if this they happen for Ghana, I they talk every time. Mm -hmm. Three basic needs: water, electricity, and then roads. Yeah. If these three basic needs, we know they fit to take off care of them. Since independence are, then we have a problem. All right. So um Chef Smith insists GWR is genuine. 
Your man. Charlie, this case, eh? Like we talk, we forgive them time. Oh, yeah, yeah. Make, make the truth for come out yeah, come before out. we go judge them. Yeah. I know what make before we quick to judge. Mm -hmm. So make we give them time. So Charlie, make we move on. Make ah, move yeah, on. yeah, yeah, yeah. They're still the roast down. So that one today. Ah. That one today. They say, well, um, um, Bank of uh, Ghana, the governor, mm -hmm. is it plans to uh, recapitalize banks and that way? I say, on our right. Mm -hmm. All right. And, uh, Oh, chairman, man roasted in Kumasi. So, man, be way then in friend, be I don't know in party of words. Then just the fight way one, one poor water for one in body. Charlie, uh, poor yeah, water. Wow. Charlie, you know, be small this thing. Yeah, wow, yeah, wow, yeah, wow. Serious, hope we be okay. Mm. And sometimes that wise people always fight that. Oh. If we leave them, oh. Charlie. you know, be say when you, you flee away from some of this, you know, the means they be weak. Oh. Oh, no. It's better for you to just. Yeah. Let go and move on. Yeah, you see, so my advice to all of us, yeah. whenever anyone upsets you, there is no need for you to, you know, be confrontational. Yeah. Just flee. Yeah. Save yourself. You oh. are Charlie Baumier's running mate's choice <laughs> in the season, solid and serious. Dr. Okoku Premper, you, like, you they, they don't want to change their mouth. So we did, we did. Chairman, it be like that be all for, for my side today. <laughs> And in the front page, um, the headlines, anti-gay bill suit, speaker surprises Supreme Court, introduces fiscal impact analysis. Um, I also have um, Herbert Krapper, nominated Minister of State at Energy Ministry. Yeah, the same story. Yeah. The same story day or day. Oh, okay. And then we also have the experts call for decisive action to save nation. Mm. Special supplement on American Chamber of Commons. Mm -hmm and failure to answer audit queries to attract sanctions. Page 9. The UK will hold its first election in almost five years. So Charlie, them hold the elections already, yeah? And um, the Labour Party has won. So Prime Minister, which is Sunak, is now quite Charlie. Oh, Charlie. That'd be nice. But the good thing, the good thing, yeah, be the smooth transition of power. Yeah, sure. You do understand? It just be the smooth transition of power. Yeah, everybody uh, understand in body. Everybody understand. Yeah. Anyway, Ghana always they have smooth transition of power. That one we know if we take it away from yeah, them. Yeah, I know they believe that. Oh, we they have them. Uh, you know, when Kufour left, mm. the next president, he yeah. handed over neatly. When Muhammad left, he left give Akufa do neatly. So transition of power there. We are hoping that but, this year too we go have smooth transition of power. Yeah. yeah? Sure. But the other thing to observe. Way I really admired was the way the everybody within the society was given a chance yeah. on certain you know platforms yeah. to be able to ask the prime minister questions. questions. Where not just only the existing prime minister, but the one two way right now day top, yeah, okay. um, would be prime minister Starmer. So yeah, they were given the opportunity to ask questions, wow. and they were able to ask questions detailed. Mm -hmm. Very questions true. but one thing i noticed for ghana we say we stand up with the give slogans oh, yeah. 24 hours your, it is possible break change eight. is coming break the eight mm -hmm. after that whole thing you know, when they go away then they talk at them campaigns if you notice that it's all about just going setting up a platform and talking to the masses to the and that's it and then they will, they will raise their hands and shout hey. Hey. immediately then talk something said so they know they understand hey. Hey. that be what ghana election be about there has never been that moment whereby yeah. lines have been open for ordinary Ghanaians to, to ask, ask questions, yeah. detailed questions as to how our candidates intend to carry out whatever promise that they they've them drop. Which is very, very necessary. Very necessary. Very, very necessary. Very necessary. Yeah, very necessary. Charlie, if we start the ask question and then you go see the way people go start the food. Then go, ah, boss, then go, you go food. Charlie, go. because, because, because all these 24 hours change it's coming. It is possible. The question is, how is this change coming? What do you intend to do? How do you intend to do it? And also, there are certain challenges. I watch one. When I ask one of the candidates, say, Charlie, I know I'm mentioning for the plan, about the state of the economy and what that person intends to do from now no, yeah. to election day, as them already have power. The answer that was given, eh, textbook knowledge. It's never specific. You see, saying things for click before you for vote. We get three people. And I, sometimes they blame people when they vote. We get three people. You know, 
certain parties that they exist now, yeah. if you do whatever you go do, the party members go vote. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. the mistake day the party is yeah. yeah, if you saw it for him. The mistake day the party is I didn't yeah. go vote. So then get somebody, you go vote because if the party come to power, you go chop. chop something. Another person to the yeah. vote because it be ethnicity reasons why yeah. they vote. Yeah. Now you where you both say you know they like say mm -hmm. the way the economy they go, and as a result of that, you don't trust anyone, you're not gonna vote. What you're causing is that you're causing for some of these parties that you don't want to be in power yeah. to keep on coming. coming. And therefore, you for vote. Your vote is your power. Because if everybody wants a change and you have to vote for a different party yeah. altogether yeah. to get that change, yeah. and you choose not to vote, and let's say 80% of everyone in Ghana okay. chooses not to vote, yeah. then that 20% go either be for the party than they like. Then they like and yeah. therefore, that party go come back again. Yeah. Yeah. So it is very important that you vote for that change True. rather than not doing anything at all. That's the thing. That's the thing. Chad. You get my point? So I encourage everyone yeah. to vote mm -hmm. so that when you vote and it doesn't come to pass, you know, say you cause them. You didn't understand? Yeah. And that transition be very important. Where we they need the campaigns? We they need a lot of platforms. All these radio stations and TV stations. Yeah. We are hoping that you give that platform for ordinary Ghanaians yeah. to yeah. ask yeah. the yeah. candidates as to how they intend to carry out these tasks. It's, for questions to be thrown to them. I think it's, it's all, all we always, uh, from time to time, what we've always been witnessing is only the journalists trying to ask them questions. Sometimes, some but the journalists have been bought, which are which are not even relevant That's because the journalists have been bought. That's the issue. You always find this journalist go and they, I mean, it's like what what are they trying to tell? You they need the ordinary Ghanaian to ask questions regarding in current state and how that can be improved. Oh no no no! You didn't understand. Sorry. We keep on hearing the economy has crashed. The economy has crashed. The economy has crashed. Yeah. However, nobody has spoken about how they intend to revive our economy. It's all about changes coming. It is possible. It is this. It is that. Look, hey, this is secondary school. Challenge. Secondary school. Like Body house prefect, dining hall prefect kind of. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. So that be the, the, the whole thing. The mass smooth transition was very good. Kudos to the United Kingdom. <laughs> page 20 yeah um there's something regarding music um music industry in dire need of archival facilities okay um, um this was being said by trigmatic yeah. uh one of ghana's greatest musicians powerful yeah. powerful yeah. he yeah. always tries to incorporate our culture in his music his words are very meaningful charlie of late some of the songs will come in eh? oh. you hear the word self charlie you know they make sense. Also, right now they be love, oh, love now, oh, love now. Now love self, I don't love their meaning. Yeah, love but some people go kakakbo, kakakbo. Like the words, no, they make sense. Yeah, they go wrong with, right now, you didn't understand, and that's what people are vibing to. But we have musicians like Trigmatic who are coming out with music with words that you know are impactful and True. and and and, and yeah. imprinted into our culture. But you see, it, it, it's, it's very hard. Me, I the first say he be underrated. Where the guy yeah. for go up. Yeah. He really be. You didn't understand. Because I, since the time he come on, like I didn't listen to him more time. I really didn't listen to Trigmatic. The guy be really good. He be very good. He be very good. So um, what he said was Ghanaian rapper Trigmatic has called for the establishment of proper archival storage facilities yeah. to safeguard the country's rich music heritage. Until it is done, the lack of adequate storage and preservative facilities is likely to erase a significant part of Ghana's culture, heritage, and identity over time. Yeah. It is very true. But first of all, the question be, do we cherish our culture? That's do we key. cherish our heritage? I mean, because what you cherish is what you yeah. want to keep. Yeah, exactly. exactly. You don't understand? Yeah. So the first question be, do we cherish it? Because it, Trigmatic can be talking about all these things, but then if the culture is not being cherished, yeah. then that means that we would disregard yeah, it regardless. We, yeah. we, we still disregard You don't understand? Yeah. Every country has a museum, yeah. and they keep things that they find very valuable. So do we cherish our musical culture yeah. and keep a museum? Because as a point he was talking about, you know, policymakers stakeholders he his cause and to invest in facilities such as music museums and li libraries 
it would allow people to explore the rich music history of Ghana. Very important. Yeah. Very, you understand? So I, I really do agree with Trigmatic. It's very important that we keep on maintaining our culture. Yeah. Because one thing about us Ghanaians is sometimes we are a bit displaced. So um, identity, our, we've lost our identity. And when you lose your identity, you keep on seeking for other identities. Oh, yeah. You keep yeah. on seeking for others to, you know, for confirmation, say you... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that like you don't understand? Say, yeah, someone say you always want to go outside to seek for validation. And validation. Stuff. That'd be the point. Validation is the word. And if you don't love your own self and you don't love your own culture and embrace your own culture, yeah. you will always find yourself being confused. being confused. And people cannot identify you. I mean, up to now. You do understand? No. Up to now. So it's very important that our music, yeah, yeah that when somebody plays our music, they should straight know that it's from it's Ghana. Right. You, you hear Brazilian songs. You hear Brazilian songs. And ah, this song, I mean, it did like it be from Brazil. Maybe in them Mexican songs, Mexican. you hear, no, you know, say it be from here. Definitely. You don't understand. And it is very important that immediately you hear Ghanaian songs, you should know it's from Ghana. Ghana. Yeah. You don't understand. Yeah, I think very important. They have to really, really look into that. They have to really, really look into Afrobeat. that. Afrobeat. We start our own. Afrobeat Ghanaian startup that shows that we have something great, something great, but because See, we know they cherish them, no exactly. somebody can't take them. We we'll take them, they market them, and give you, then sell them, give you. We will sell them, they own them. Well, we will not even get the copyright this year, hey. so it means that now no, the other man saying you know, play it. I say Chinese people go, they play Afrobeat right now. Chinese, China, they play Afrobeat belongs to Ghana, but <laughs> look, uh, we will not go feel you say Ghanaians, it will be 10 debate right now, no. but we will start them. So I agree with what Trigmatic said. But Charlie, seriously, on the serial note, Daily Graphic do one bad. How you go feel blame a man in face? Mm -hmm. No, seriously, please, your pictures. It should be clear. You can't be blaring pictures. And I think the artists should be asked so that they provide the best pictures of themselves. Eh? To, to this but newspaper I think, agent. I think they can prove the artists will provide the best picture they have. But they will blame them. They will blame them because they don't get that. I check that. <laughs> so that's it that's a wrap up for today's edition charlie guys you know how we do it you know we always give it to you back to back we'll come back tomorrow for another juicy news again as you already know kindly subscribe like comment and share and keep the notification bell on as well so that we can grow together you understand thank you very much for staying with us again peace out bye peace out